Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on the Arch SMP. And today, I want to build an iron farm. Because, recently, I was being annoyed in real life by, by uh, some fans to make an iron farm. So, I have all the materials right here. And, I guess I just need to pick a place and build it. So, I was thinking the village over there, since we get three easy villagers. Unless they were killed already. I'm gonna go check. So I'm hearing villager sounds from there. However, there's just one villager. And I can actually zoom in on my mini map to find more villagers. However, I don't think there's any more villagers in this village. There is one more. Where? Where? Are they the green dots? Yeah. There's only uh, one. They're in this cavern. There's a villager in this cavern over here. At me, where I am. Okay, He's well, can okay. you trap him? Yeah. Okay, well, we'll oh, so we will have to breed the villagers right. since we need three villagers. I forgot to bring anything. Let's go back. So I have all the things that I need. Now it's time to bring over the first villager with a lead. Where is this villager gone? This uh, it's over by me. Okay. okay. That would make that life would make so, much so much easier. What happened to this house? Oh, I Where's destroyed the... it for the Why? resources. Hey, where did the villager go? The villager go? It's just, he's over here. Wait, no, there's another uh, one in the wild. Oh my god, that villager despawned, I think. Really? Yes. So the villagers so the completely villager disappeared. disappeared? It's underground. underground. I hear it. But I can't see it. I just blocked him up. Oh, he's, oh, he's underground. In a cave. In a cave. Is this like a, like a how do I make a villager, villager get in like a lead? Uh, I don't know. Do you touch him with it? No, it's not working. Oh, you can't lead villagers. Uh, uh dang you it. You have to put them in boats. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, come on. You know what, I'll just trap them. That'll probably be l much easier. The villager I had didn't despawn. I just forgot where I put him. Okay, well, I'm gonna well, need you gonna to bring him over, bring here. him over here. Oh, well... The funny thing is, he's in a cave, so I can't really get to them. Same. Or not, he's not in a cave, he's in a box underground. Oh. That I put. So the villager is now over here, but we don't really know what to do from now. Yeah, this is gonna be a problem. So, I now need to give each villager three bread, so can you like move away so that the villagers like... ...can eat? Alright! I gotta place the bed now. Uh, okay, wait, no, let, let's go away. Get up. Now, if we give it a bit of time. Oh, wait, no. No, what, what did you do? What did you do? What did you do? Block it off, block it off. There. It's fine now. So, in the next 20 minutes... It's gonna take 20 minutes for them to actually produce a villager and another 20 minutes for them to grow up. Time to wait. So the villagers are now See, breeding. Yeah. Go, move, Go move, away. move away, move away. I'm pretty sure you can't be near. No! No, 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 no move, move. Okay, so now there's a third villager. 
Don't let them Don't get let out. Them get out. I know, I was trying to get out myself and I didn't have blocks on. Okay, whatever. Now that there's three villagers, we can start building the actual farm. I'm just gonna remove these beds and yeah, I guess it's time to start building the actual farm. So apparently I have to dig out this entire area, which is, well, it's gonna be a pain. Everything's a pain. So the hole is now dug and this is the center block. And now I have to start building the actual farm. So it is now time that we get the zombie into this hole, this very hole right here. And it's gonna be a bit of a challenge. So I'm building a staircase, which should allow me to simply take a zombie and put it in this box. And these little placeholder blocks right here should help me um, get the zombie in the right location. And I'm gonna get out the leads and go hunting for a zombie. So it is turning day and for some reason, okay, there's a zombie, but it's there. So I got a zombie. Time to lead it to where it belongs. It just, oh my gosh. Now I have to kill it. So I have switched the location of the farm because the old one, it sort of got filled with zombies and all the villagers got killed. So I have to start from scratch. This is gonna be fun. So the mob chambers are now done and I guess I can start getting the villagers into them. So I need to build a little staircase for the villagers to go through. And I only need three villagers, however, there are like five or something in this. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, um, a lot of them fell down into here, so yeah. Now I need to get one of them up. How do I get them up? Can I like drop bread? No, I can't. Come on, get the bread. Get the bread. You're almost there. And now I just need to... Um, lock them in there, I guess. However, there's two in there. Which is a slight problem. Oh no. How, uh, how do I get them out? This is gonna be a pain. Since one of them's already sleeping, I think I'm just gonna push this other one out. And it should just work like that. However, it is not. Come on. Come on. Here's some, no, 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 no. No, you stay back. Uh, oh, oh no. Okay, come on, come on. Get the bread. Dumb villager. What just happened? Why are villagers getting hurt? Oh my gosh, what? What is happening? Get over here, stupid villager. I hate villagers for this very reason. Oh my god. Just, okay, move. Get out of here. Get out. Get out. Now there, there's more coming in. Oh my gosh, this is going horribly wrong. No! No! Get back down there. Get off! Get out! What is wrong with these villagers? And they keep trying to get back up. Okay, now they can't get back up. Now this one's stuck in here. Great, great, absolutely fantastic. Oh my God. <sighs> Take some bread. Come on, come on. 
Leave. They are so stubborn. I had to do it. Now, this one. It's stuck in that corner, and it's not moving. Okay. Now, it can't get back up. <sighs> Perfect. And I have to fix these, uh, walls. There. So, the first, uh, villager thing is done. Where did my torch go? There. And now I just have to do that two more times. Great. Two down, one to go. Finally. It's almost done. So that third villager was surprisingly easy to get in there. So now these villagers are just to kill. No, just kidding. We're gonna be saving that for a villager breeder which is coming very soon. Make sure to subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss that. And now it's time to, oh shoot, I gotta get the zombie in. Well, thankfully it's night and there should be mobs around, so that's helpful. So I need to build a staircase so that the zombie can get, oh, well, it's gonna be a lot easier since Oh shoot, I need to cover up all of these villager things so that the zombies can't attack the villagers. Because that is what happened last time. Now are there any more zombies before it becomes a uh, day? Really? Are you serious? Oh, well, okay. Quick, quick, I can't let it burn up. Because yesterday, uh, I spent a lot of the time actually waiting rather than um, building because I couldn't find the zombie. And it's raining, so that mean it, uh, it should, yeah, yeah, come on. Come on, come on, get get in there. Get in there. Stupid zombie. It can't figure out how to get in there. Okay, this is not going well. Now, all you gotta do is fall in the hole. Are you serious? I also forgot that my name tag needs to actually be named. So I have to go all the way back to my base and name the name tag. Because otherwise the zombie will despawn. So I named the name tag and got a zombie. Now I just need to make it get in the hole. C come on. Are you serious? Okay, the zombie's right there. Come on. Get in the hole. The zombie simply won't get in the hole. And it's annoying. Okay. Uh, that, that failed. Come on! Get in here! Now the iron golem's gonna kill it. Okay, no, it did not fall down there. Come on! Get in there! Now it doesn't have a choice, and finally it's in there. So I can name it. So this like, I'm pretty sure this is the iron golem spawning place. It's done. Uh, I think. So now I need to make the killing system, item collection system, and then start the actual farm. We're making progress here.
So I'm currently making progress on the item collection system. And I need to build up some walls just so that the iron golem can never escape. And then I should, in theory, be all set to uh, start the farm. So the hold to the um, item collection system is now complete. And if I destroy these, the farm should start. So let's see. The first villager, yes, it starts panicking. And an iron golem should spawn. Oh. Oh man. It's already. Already they're coming in. Wow. What did we get? Four iron. This is already crazy. Okay, the villagers are panicking again. I think. A new golem should spawn anytime. Oh yes, another one spawned. So the rates are probably not going to be that great. Because it is far away from my base. And I AFK at my base. Which is sort of unfortunate. However, I believe uh, this gives 300 items per hour. And I can totally believe that. So thanks for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and I am out.